I'm a mother to all my little girls. And now, I'll leave you to your farewell. My daddy has to go away. But he'll return most any day. Any... <laughs> I can't do it this time. I can't do it. We must eat something. After all the trouble little Sarah's gone to. I think she'll understand. You've forgotten your ring. No, I haven't. See? I'm always afraid I'll forget and wear it in front of Miss Mansion. I did yesterday, and fortunately for us, she didn't see it. How oh, I'd love to tell the old girl. Can't do that yet, darling. I know. You sorry you married me? As though you didn't know. I only wanted you to tell me again. I thought you were having Mr. Hamilton to tea. I am. I mean, I was, but... Who's in that room? Oh, please don't go in there, Miss Minchin. <sighs> Miss Minchin, Miss Rose and I... We, we were saying goodbye, Miss Minchin. How dare you risk the reputation of my school in this manner? Nothing's happened that damages your precious school's reputation. As a matter of fact, Miss Rose and I... Jeffrey, for my sake. Please, Miss Minchin. It was all my fault. Silence. Oh, I'm not frightened, Miss. I'm frightened, too. This time, Becky, come on, give me your hand. Look out. Oh, hello, Miss. Don't be afraid, Becky. Ah, what game is this, little Missy Sarge? May we please go through your house? We're running away from the police. And a very nice game, too. Will you enter? We'd like to very much indeed. You seem in great haste, Mrs. Sir. Could you not stop for a cup of tea? Oh, thank you. We're in too big a hurry. I see. Still playing the game of the police. I hope you escaped them safely, Mrs. Sir. Oh, why? 